Hello and welcome to Transformation Tuesdays. This is the main health channel on YouTube. You know, today I want to share a little bit about what I do in my treatment center. Um, I work with a lot of people who suffer from alopecia. And alopecia is just the technical term for um, excessive hair loss. So when you get a diagnosis of alopecia, normally it is not just a normal shedding that most of us experience, but usually it is excessive and abnormal hair loss. And I have a secret for you that regardless of what type of hair loss that you have, most hair loss, whether you're a man or a woman, whether it's female or male pattern baldness really has one common denominator. Listen real closely to the secret I'm going to share with you. Hair loss is just a symptom that something in your body is going wrong. It's really amazing. When God made our bodies, He made our body system so intricate and detailed that when something in our body goes awry there are different symptoms that manifest elsewhere to let us know. Hippocrates said this, he said let medicine be thy food and food be thy medicine and I'll let you know what I mean by that. When I am interviewing people who come to my help because hair loss is now reaching epidemic proportions, I take very careful time in a consultation to try to determine exactly where it started. Your hair will remain on top of your head unless there is some type of condition that emerges. And that condition can be something as simple as a hereditary um, ailment that makes you susceptible to male or female pattern baldness or hormonal deficiency or the like. Now when people come to me with some ailments when it deals with their scalp or their hair it is amazing how a lot of times I am able to uh, prescribe different um, topical agents, whether they're shampoos, conditioners, um, or even sometimes vitamin supplements in order to um, prohibit DHT or whatever uh, condition that I believe that we're working with at the present time. Whether it has a uh, a smell to it or a consistency that may not be the best. Things that can be put on topically don't receive the resistance that I get once I start to share with people about eating better. Your body systems are very important when it comes to the way the rest of your body um, reacts. Case in point, your hair, your skin, and your nails are the last three in the body systems to be fed. So it's very important that you plan to eat good because your body takes all these nutrients in and if you're not eating protein rich or whole foods then those other things that you eat are ingested by the different systems and the last thing to be fed are going to be your hair, your skin, and your nails. And if you're not getting adequate nutrition to those areas, those are the first things that you'll start seeing a deficiency in. So for some reason, I get the most pushback when I try to encourage people to eat better and not only will they see a difference in their hair but they'll start to see a whole total difference so this is what I'm going to share with you that I share with my customers in my treatment center and wig store 
Stop eating crap. Start eating food. Here's today's food for thought. Thank you for joining me here once again for Transformation Tuesdays here on the Main Health Channel. Take care, be blessed, and see you next week. Bye.